Hello all. In this video I am going to demonstrate a homemade float. This is a homemade float. I have used one bottle, empty bottle, water bottle and I am using a bar magnet in inside and a reed switch inside. I will unbox the whole thing. Just have a look. So I have unboxed each and every component of the system. So this is my water bottle. This is the cap of the water bottle and here you can see the reed switch. This is my reed switch. Okay. And it is and here this is a bar magnet. Okay. So now for making this float what I am doing I am using the bar magnet inside this, this bottle. I am keeping the bar magnet and this setup as you can see this is just a simple reed switch with a connector. I am connecting it with the connecting it as the, the cap I am connecting with the bottle. So I have connected the cap in the bottle. So now my reed switch is ready. Only thing is that here the connect connections are op seems to be open. I need to put some sealing compound here so that water does not go inside. So now this thing has to be kept in a tank. Right now I don't have a tank. I am just demonstrating the motion. So this is my multimeter and you can see the multimeter is open contact. That means the reed switch is open. As you can see the reed switch is open. Now the reed switch is open. Now the t assuming the tank is having low level and the float will be hanging like this. So there is no 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 water in the tank and the float will be hanging. Now I am, I am assuming there is water in the tank. What will happen? The water will the float will start floating on the water and it will become like this and as and you can see the magnet comes close to the reed switch and the switch gets closed. The contact is closed. Okay. No water in the tank. The no, there is no contact. There is water in the tank. The contact is closed. No water in the tank. There is no contact. I repeat, there is water in the tank. The contact is closed. So this is a basic read switch. This is a basic read switch uh, I have made. So thanks a lot. Thanks for watching. You can use the same. You can make the same and use in some practical applications. In this, in the next video, I am going to interface it with a circuit so that I can switch on a light. A switch on a lamp and use and have some proper usage of the circuit thanks a lot thanks for watching please like share and subscribe please support my channel thank you very much